How a frog becomes a frog. I love to go fishing at the park near my house. There are lots of animals that live around the pond, not just fish. You see insects like dragonflies, butterflies, even itchy mosquitoes, and birds like ducks and herons. One day when I was there with my grandpa, I noticed a bunch of bubbles attached to a leaf in the water. Grandpa said they weren't bubbles at all. The tiny balls were frog eggs. Frogs are amphibians. They can breathe underwater through their skin. They also have lungs like people and can breathe air. When we got home, Grandpa taught me even more about frogs. We visited the pond all summer to watch what happens to the eggs. It's called metamorphosis. When the eggs hatch, the baby frogs sort of look like fish. They're called tadpoles. The tadpoles swim around the pond happily and eventually grow cute little legs to go with their long tails. Over time, the tadpoles' tails get much smaller and their legs get bigger and stronger. They still live in the water, but now they're called froglets. A few months after the tadpoles hatch from their eggs, the froglets' tails disappear and they climb out of the water. Now they are officially grown-up frogs. They spend a lot of time hopping around, but they like to hang out in the pond too. Now when I go fishing, my frog buddies are always there to greet me. Can you think of other animals and plants that change as they grow?